case does murder talk. In the early 1900s, there were many crimes that were committed, some of the crimes were revolved around the passion of love and jealousy. On October 28, 1919, a man named William Wright was drinking in the Caster's public house the Talbot, which is now a Lincolnshire cooperative food store. After many drinks William started to mutter the words murder, black cap, three weeks, hanged by neck and finished. Many who were in the Talbot that night thought William was blabbering due to him being drunk, but they soon learned the truth. Annie Colbeck, became impregnated with William's child, they both arranged to meet at the Pigeon Spring, horse market. Annie was wearing a brooch that William had not seen before, William did ask her about the jewellery, Annie simply explained it was a gift from her mother. William was a jealous guy, who struggled to believe in Annie and thought she had a lover. That evening Annie stayed at a hotel in Caister. At 10 o'clock in the evening Annie was joined by William. Shortly after William forcefully wrapped a scarf around Annie's neck and strangled her to death, William then fled the scene and Annie's body was not discovered until the next morning. It was not long till the law caught up with William, when William was taken into custody he admitted to strangling Annie. William also admitted it was caused by the brooch Annie was wearing. In William's statement he also mentioned that he went home afterwards. William stuck by his testimony in court, the defense also tried to back William's case by stating William was not in sound mind when the crime was committed. Mental issues became a big deal in William's case as his mother had been placed in Lincoln County Asylum in 1918, so had his sister who had religious mania and his uncle too. William's uncle had died in the asylum before his mother was sent there. The defense also described William as having mental issues, due to what William had seen while serving with the army, and also the family history. When the witnesses from the Talbot, who had heard William mutter his words, disagreed with the court's defense. William had been drinking in the Talbot shortly before the murder took place, which sealed William's fate. At the prison, William asked to see the chaplain. Where William admitted he did mean to kill Annie. There had been 13 years since the last execution at Lincoln's prison, when William was put to justice by the hands of Henry Pierpoint. Harry did indeed wear a black cap, for William's execution five weeks after the trial and it only took 30 seconds for William to die. A local newspaper followed the story from the trial all the way to William's death, and there is also detailed recordings of the execution by the hands of Henry Pierpoint at Lincoln Goal.